there's a rat in your bed. <gasps> there's a rat in your bed. Get him. <laughs> oh, darling, good morning, sweetheart. Where's your brother? Has he gone outside for a few wee wee's? You didn't want to go out, do you? You are funny. She will hold herself and hold herself when it's raining. You're such a princess. Darling, I hate to remind you of this, but you are a cocker spaniel and you are supposed to be a working dog. But go <laughs> that side eye. Oh, no, 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 I'm actually not mum. I was born for the lady of leisure life. You're supposed to go out in all weathers, yeah? Picking up pheasants. Oh, you're giving me your Disney dog face. Don't you think, guys, oh, she would have been the perfect Disney dog? Look at those puppy eyes. Are you a Disney dog? That's the face. <laughs> you're such a Disney dog. I think if I hadn't have called her Desi, I would have 100% called her Disney. Maybe if we ever get another one, it will be Disney. Desi, Disney and Spag Bolly. Yes. Speaking of Bolly. Oh, hello. We have another hard working Spaniel. Hello, my little freeloader. Should we go and pop the Christmas lights on? Come on, morning ritual. Excuse me, we're not having a lie-in. Come down here, sir. Come on. <laughs> We've got to put the lights on, look. I left this living room spotless yesterday. Lo and behold, this blinking Christmas parsnip that is haunting my dreams. Why does this parsnip get out and about more than me? <laughs> Why is he always everywhere? This is like the new elf on the shelf. We don't have an elf on the shelf in this house. We have a parsnip in the living room. Oh, we don't have a fun catchy name for this. A legume in the room? It's not a legume. Hmm, veggie in the... I don't know. Can we come up with a catchy name for finding this parsnip absolutely everywhere around the house? Look at his annoying smiley face. <laughs> Good catch, Bol. Ah, oh, right, we need to get ready for the day, don't we? We're not having a day at home today. No, we're not. Come on, puppers. Good morning, guys, and welcome back to my channel and welcome to another day of Vlogmas. It's an early morning. I do have some lovely plans for today, hence the early morning. First of all, I'm just going to quickly show you this, uh, like what I'm wearing, because I have been asked a couple of times now about this dressing gown. It's actually not a dressing gown. This is actually a set that I bought from H&M. So it's technically a cardigan with a tie waist. Oh, it's a dressing gown. But it has the trousers, like the fluffy cream trousers to match. Oh, Desi. So it's like a two-piece loungewear set. Really cuddly and fluffy. So cosy to wear at this time of year. Um, I've had this for, I want to say, a couple of years now, and yeah, I love getting this set out. But anyway, today is a really fun day because I'm actually heading down to Bista Village to do some shopping, and I'm meeting up with Leonora, and we're going to have a really fun Christmassy, girly shopping day. Can't wait to have a look and see what's there because it's actually been... I think it's been over two years since I was last at Vista Village. So it will be so good to have a look around the shops, see what goodies they've got in. Bring you guys along with us. And yeah, I think it's just going to be a really fun, girly afternoon. I really hope you enjoy today's video, guys. Just come and shopping with us. Have a few laughs and it's going to be a good one. But first, I absolutely cannot get ready to leave the house without making a cup of tea first. Right, good morning guys. I've just finished doing my makeup and oh that's what I need to do, check the weather. Because yesterday when I checked the weather for today down in Bista, 
it's, it was forecast heavy downpours all day. What are we so Oh, that's gone. Oh, no rain. Oh, blinking brilliant. Right. No rain. Scrap that. The weather's going to be okay. Hello, little one. Of course, Desi's come in because I'm speaking to the camera. I was just planning on doing my hair, but I'm in one of those moods where, you know when you you know you've got a long day outside shopping, I really feel like I don't want my hair around my face. I always have my hair sort of with that blow dried look and I'm just not feeling that today. I think I'm either gonna do slick back bun, but then I'm thinking, I usually like to save that for when my hair needs a wash. <laughs> so I don't know what to do. Hmm. Do we do a slick rig bun? And I'm half thinking, should I pop in one of my headbands and go for maybe like the ap apres ski chalet girl vibes? I love these elasticated headbands. And then I also, what is that? A bit of dry shampoo, great. And I also think I can't, they look a tiny bit sporty and I look like I'm kind of limbering up, ready to go shopping. <laughs> like I've got my sweatbands on. I actually think I'm going to go for this. I'm going to go for this. I'm going to pop my headband on. We're going to go chalet girl vibes for today. Seeing as it's not going to be raining, I thought I was going to have to do a slick back bun. Not anymore. But yeah, I'm thinking gold jewellery, headband, that would be really nice. And because I'm going to be having my headband on, I'm going to pop on my highlighter. Let me grab it. I sometimes don't use this one if I'm having my hair sort of down around my face. Because it is... Um, it's slight, I'd say slightly sticky, so if it's windy or whatever, it's one of them where hair's going to stick to your face and, oh, girls, we know we, do, we don't need that annoyance when we're trying to shop. We need to concentrate. <laughs> so I'm going to use this one today, seeing as my hair is going to be nicely off my face because it is one of my favourite highlighters, I will say. It gives you such a good highlight. Where's my mirror gone now? But yeah, seeing as whenever my hair's off my face, I like to have a really good highlight. Oh, can we see that? It gives that almost wet look to your skin. You have to squeeze the tube really hard and then it shoots out. Right, don't need too much of this either. Gorgeous. Not saying that about me, by the way. <laughs> Starting off the morning really big-headedly. Look in the mirror, gorgeous. No, the highlight is definitely very gorgeous. Oops. I like to put some just down, kind of this bit of my nose, just the bridge of my nose. A little bit oh, on the tip, not too much. I've got hair stuck to my face, so that needs to go. There we go, can you see? And just a little bit, kind of just above my brow bone, kind of where naturally the light would hit your face and you want to have that bit of a glow. Okay, I'm quite happy with that. I feel like I just need a little bit of um, bronzer. There we go. Okay. Lip combo for today, guys. I've used MAC Spice Lip Liner. I rarely use that on its own, but I'm actually really kind of liking the pinkier undertone. Um, yes, yeah, so I've used MAC Spice, and then I've used, oh, MAC Peach Stock. Just a tiny dab on the center for my lips today. Okay, I'm gonna quickly wash my hands, and then we're gonna get this headband in and play around, see what it looks like. So the only problem with these fabric ones is if you're wearing dry shampoo or anything, you can kind of, like when you're putting a top on when you've just put deodorant on, you can sort of get little white marks. So I'm just making sure it looks clean. Hello, lady. What do you want? Do you want to come up to me? Come on then. Let me pick you up. Come on then. Oh, as soon as I say, do you want me to pick you up? They're both here. Hello. Can you see him? No. Can you see an ear? There we go. What? You, you don't sit still though. Come on then, big jump. Big jump. Oh, that was a big jump. Look, now this is going to be really hard, isn't it, to do my hair with you. Okay, we're going to sit still. You can look out the window. I know, you're, <laughs> you're a bit more chaotic than Desi, aren't you? Now, I can't have kisses while I'm doing this. Oh, I just want to snuck. I'm, I'm a good boy. Okay, careful. <laughs> this is not... The way I intended to do my hair this morning, Bolly, with you sat on my lap. I'm going to kind of find my centre parting a little bit. People always laugh at me, by the way, because I brush my hair. 
with one of the heads off my Dyson hair up. I promise I do own brushes. But you know in the morning when you just want to get your hair done, I just grab the nearest thing and it's usually my Dyson hair up. So I just take one of the heads off and I use it to brush my hair. Oh, I know. I know. Oh, dear. Hello. What? God. This is not how I thought I'd be getting ready. These little tails wagging down here. This isn't how I thought I'd be getting ready this morning, puppy. Yes, yeah, so I need to. I need to kind of concentrate a little bit now. Oh, oh! I thought you literally lay down. Right, get your foot there. There you go. I've lit, my arm is trapped. Come on, I need to get ready. Oh, there we go. That's comfortable, isn't it? But I do need to bring my arm away from you. There we go. I rarely get this on first time. Oh, you're getting down? Good boy. That's easier. There we go. There we go. Can we see what we mean by kind of chalet girl vibes? I'm going to add some little waves in here. Oh, let me change my battery first. Now I'm going to pop some earrings in and then I'm just going to kind of tweak tweak this um, hair a little bit. Which earrings should we go for? So I've got these gorgeous little Fendi hoops. Andy actually bought me these last year for Christmas. And I just love, because I'm a gold jewellery wearer, I love, if we focus, on the one side they are gold. Hello, there we go. And on the other side, you've got the silver twinkles. So I could wear those. Or I've got my little gold lunar hoops. I'm kind of feeling because my hair's off my face, I need a little bit more of a bigger, chunkier earring. All oh, those look nice. My little Bottega earring dupes. Oh, they look nice. I think I'm going to go for these. We'll wear these ones today. And I think I'm going to use my Fendi handbag. So Fendi earrings and a Fendi handbag might look a little bit overkill. Yeah, these look nice, don't they? Don't they? Why did I say it like that? To be honest, my hair looks actually all right like this. I'm just going to add in a couple more... Just the odd couple here and there. Sorry, I'm looking round the camera to see my big mirror here. But yeah, I don't want my hair to look like I've tried too hard. So I'm just going to kind of flick the ends under a little bit. Like that. So it kind of looks like, has she had rollers in? Is this an old blow dry? Who knows, eh? Apart from all you lot at home. I know exactly how I've done it. It's the best way to make your hair just look a little bit fresher. And I think I'm going to use some of my um, texturising spray to give it a bit of oomph. There we go. Now, once I kind of brush those out, can you see the difference it makes? This one's just a little bit more lived in. This is a bit fresher. I'll brush these out and we'll be golden. But as I said, I'm going down to Bister Village today. I can't wait because I've not been for so long. So the last time I was there was a very successful trip. I actually bought my Burberry trench coat from there for half price. And I love that thing. If, if you watch my videos, you'll have seen it many a time. But yeah, that is where I got it from. And then also, another thing I got from there. Let me quickly show you them actually. They're only here. My Fendi ankle boots. Can you see? They've got the monogram on, but kind of subtle. So yeah, and I love the Fendi zips at the back. I got those from Bister Village last time I was there. Oh my god, I got them for such a bargain. So, went into the Fendi outlet there, spotted the boots, love at first sight, knew I'd get so much wear out of them. And they always have, like, how much they're supposed to be at normal value. And I think it was something like £900 they were supposed to be. Anyway, they were four fifty there, so half price. So I was like, Do you know what? I'm going to treat myself because I love Fendi as a brand. I just I just loved those boots. Sprinted with them to the till, very excited to buy them. And the guy at the till was, you know, scanning them, whatever, and he scanned them and he said, oh, these are half price. And I was like, yeah, I know, it's good, isn't it? Thinking he meant, you know, they're supposed to be 900 and they were 450. And he was like, no, 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 they're half price today. So they're half 450. So I got these boots for like 220 quid. And they are so good. I can't explain how, one, how comfortable they are. I know they've only got a small heel, but you can walk in them all day. They don't hurt. Really great. 
yeah, one of the best purchases I've ever made at Worcester Village. So £200 down from £900. This is a spray I'm going to use. This is from Living Proof. They're full, dry, volume and texture spray. I'd say this is a little bit like a hybrid between dry shampoo and hairspray. Good for kind of... I usually just kind of butterfly my hair. I know it looks a bit wild now, but if your hair has gone a little bit limp and you want to add a bit of volume, this is what I do. Now I know this looks a bit wild, but give it a couple of seconds, brush it through, and then yeah, it'll just be nice volume, not like Hagrid as it is right now. Anyway, I need to get changed. I need to find something to wear. Oh no, we'll find something. I'm gonna pop my outfit on show you what I'm wearing and then yeah let's get going down to Vista Village for a fun girly shopping day. Do we go full chalet girl chic and go for the <laughs> go for this jumper? It is very cute but perhaps not for Vista Village maybe more a bit more for something more chilled I don't know. I do every time I put this headband on I just want to wear something cute like this maybe this with some tights my boots a nice black coat I'm going to see. I'm going to play around. We'll find something. Okay, I've gone for... Oh, let me turn the podcast off. I've gone for plain black. So I'm wearing my plain black uh, mohair jumper from h and I've got my shorts on underneath, tights, whoop, riding boots. I'm kind of liking this all black vibe. And then I've got my black jacket from... I wonder I can't find the arm. There we go. Black jacket from Goelia. Do I look a bit morbid? dressed all in black. Is this me mourning my bank balance before I go to Bista Village? I'm kind of thinking, nice jacket, because you can do this up and add a belt and that might look quite nice actually. Maybe if I... I mean, I don't know why I'm doing this now. I'm 100% not going to drive down in my coat, but that might look nice. And there is actually a belt that came with this, but it's like, it's like an elasticated thing. It's quite nice because it's understated. Then I don't know, is it too? Is it not enough? That is one thing I would really like actually, a nice new black belt to wear. Yeah, I thought like that's not going to stay. But you can see the vibe that it gives with the belt. I'm thinking maybe not the belt. I've just swapped that belt out because I felt like it just wasn't enough. I've actually just popped on my Holland Cooper belt because I feel like it just needs that little bit of gold because it is a very dark outfit. I actually think that's quite nice. I quite like that. Yeah, I think that's what I'm going to go with. Bag-wise, I was really wanting my Fendi bag. I think that'll be really nice because it is an all-black outfit, just to lighten it slightly. Yeah, I think I think this is the outfit, guys. I think I'm ready. Oh, perfume. I'm going to use a little bit of the um, Tucker, the one that Josie did with them. Lovely. Lovely. Okay, I'm going to now jump in the car, head down, meet Leo, and let's have a good shopping day, guys. And just like that, I have arrived. So I have just parked the car up. Leo is about 10 minutes away. So I'm actually going to head into the apartment and maybe grab myself a cup of tea. If you do come shopping at Bista Village and you want to make a really like great day of it, I highly recommend booking an appointment in the apartment because you can sit in there. It's really quiet. It's a beautiful, um, beautiful apartment. You can sit, you can have uh, maybe a glass of champagne, a cup of tea, a coffee, and it also gives you the ability to do hands-free shopping. So if you do want to have a big shopping day and obviously you don't want to be carrying loads loads and loads of bags around you can have it so that when you buy something in store they will keep the shopping for you and they'll have it delivered to the apartment so that at the end of the day you can go back into the apartment and grab all of your shopping and yeah it just makes for a far easier day of shopping but anyway I am going to grab my stuff how has my makeup lasted oh we're looking okay we're looking okay let me grab my bits I've got my bag my camera and yeah, I'm excited. I think Leo should be here any minute. So I'm going to go inside and uh, have a nice cup of tea, maybe show you around and wait for her to get here. It's so lovely to be back at Bista Village after what feels like so long. I'm really in the mood for a fun shopping day anyway. And we've also got lunch booked later. Oh, I can't wait. Now hurry up Leo and get here because I'm excited. And 
And look who's here. Hi, my angels. Oh, she's arrived. We have actually just been in the apartment. I've had a lovely cup of tea. I've Lee. had a black coffee instead like of my Black soul. coffee. <laughs> I think Leo needs it literally injecting into her veins yes, right now. I do. With, <laughs> with this slap to me. With the manic chaos of Vlogmas. It's just, oh, it's all go, 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 isn't it? It's wild, it's, but it's so exciting. It is exciting. Are you enjoying filming Vlogmas? I am. I just, it? I love Christmas. So anything festive. And do you know what? It's so special this year because, you know what? I've like properly given it a go. Last yeah. year I did. And you've got to, you can't do it half No. You can't. Gotta throw yourself in. So um, just hope everybody enjoys it as much as I've loved oh, it. Well, I know everyone on my channel loves seeing you on here. So yeah, I think it's going to be a very fun day. We're going to oh, so much shopping to be done, and it's not that busy here at the minute. No, it's, is not. It? it's it's actually so quite nice. Quiet. So we're going to do some serious yeah. damage. But first, we're heading to Astrid and Miu to have a look at their lovely jewellery. They've got this new bracelet that they've brought out. And I think that's specifically what we're going to be having a look at today. I will check in with you in a minute once we get there. Just arrived, Astrid and me, you. Look at this gorgeous little setup. Looks like a little greenhouse. It's very cute around all the Christmas trees. Oh my gosh, these gold hoops are just so nice. Look at these. They're so lovely, gold and silver. I love them. Only £42 as well. That's so good. Beautiful. gorgeous are these bracelets you've got the earrings to match and you can even have the hoop version as well these gold hoops have my name all over them absolutely adore them and it's really making me want to get another piercing seeing all of these are so lovely look at these little hoops so so sweet they've also got their advent calendar up here i've seen a few people unboxing this there are some absolute goodies in here so good I'm getting all of the inspo just from this ear. I really wish I was brave. I love the dainty little hoops. I think that might have to be one of my goals in 2024. Get a few more piercings, be a brave girl because that's how I would really love my ear to look, to be honest. So I just need to show you, this is the whole reason we have stopped by here today. These are the gorgeous Astrid and Miu bracelets, but they have just come out with a brand new one. So we've got a few of the classics here. We've got their Astrid, their Chelsea, is that right? Yeah. Oh. <laughs> Look at me, I'm learning quick Marlebone. And their new one, which is it's this one, I yeah. yeah. So this one, I that gold one is just gorgeous. Are you a gold or silver girl? I'm a gold. You're a gold girl as well. You, everyone's got a preference, haven't they? Yeah. You've got you silver. I'm silver. You're a today, silver girl. But I do think yeah. it's possible. Like, look at my hands. You can yeah. rock both. I think, yeah. I so love mixing like metals. And rings. Yeah, I, and then a I love mixing metals. I love, especially in winter. Definitely. Because I feel like it's icy. It's oh, nice. Yeah. It's really nice to have silver. But yeah, as well as the bracelets, you can add on your own little charms. But look at these gemstones, so sweet. I've just been trying to find mine. So mine is June, so I am the moonstone, which means new beginnings. Uh, Leo. I'm a peridot. <laughs> peridot, strength and harmony. That's nice. That. That's, That's really nice. nice. That's lovely. So these are the charms that you can have on the bracelet as well as your birthstone. So as you can see, you can get your initials. There's also um, other alternatives to your birthstone up here. These really little dainty ones are so sweet. Oh, oh you've got the little star signs down here. That's cute. I don't know what to do. I need to choose. Okay, so I've chosen what I'm gonna have on my bracelet. I've just got measured up and I'm actually gonna watch this get made in front of me today. So if you do want to come in and maybe treat yourself or someone you love, I'm all for treating yourself to a Christmas present, you can actually pop in here at Vista Village. They're here until March and design your own bracelet and add all of your charms, your gemstones, whatever you like, and it will be made right in front of you. So yeah, that's what we're here to do now. <laughs> this looks very um, intricate. <laughs> I imagine this isn't a job for someone with shaky hands. I struggle to get the back on my earrings. <laughs> yeah, I'm doing this. 
Right, if I could have your space. Thank you. Going in. Mm -hmm. She's going in. It's being welded to her wrist. Well, not to my wrist. <laughs> no. <laughs> Onto her wrist. <laughs> Permanent fixture on my body. Feel free. Thank you. Oh, How does that look fit size-wise for you? I yeah. can change it. No, that way. feels per that's not too big. That's perfect. Oh, look at that. So I've got Bolly and Desi's initials and then my birthstone in the middle. Get a close-up. They're going to be so happy. <laughs> They're going to be so happy. <laughs> <gonna be so, laughs> what and about the boyfriend? And Andy's going to be like, excuse me. out of joint. <laughs> <laughs> After 10 years and you've put the dogs on a bracelet. And Absolutely. <laughs> he knows his place. He knows his place. <laughs> You might be mistaken for thinking I'm having some keyhole surgery, but we're actually getting ready now to weld the bracelet on. This is permanent, guys. So Desi and Bolly, you best behave. This bracelet is stuck forever. And I can't wait to see Andy's reaction when I get home. <laughs> so Leo's actually having an M. I've got a bit of a sticky situation. I really hope Mark sticks around. Yeah. Otherwise, you know, the bracelet. Or you could can just get like another dog. Me. And name it something beginning with an M. I know, it's a bit tricky because, you know, I'm, I'm probably going to end up with the entire alphabet yeah. on my <laughs> I wrist. Say, yeah, I did want to do something I wanted similar to do the dogs, with the dogs, but then she'd um, need about 800 letters. Yeah, <laughs> slight tricky situation, so I thought it'd be easier. I thought if I did an L, a little bit much. Um, but M, you know, could be Mark. Could be my middle name, Madeleine. Yeah. Could be my middle it name if things go Mark. wrong. Yeah. I'm sure Mark's going to be over the Hopefully he'll behave himself. I'm not going to tell Andy that you've got an M. Because Andy's no, got don't, one, mine. Don't. <laughs> this is so intricate. We're done. And that's done, yeah. We're done. Got that, that's guys. All done. We're all done. Where have the letters gone? They've rolled, oh, they've rolled around here. So gorgeous. Gorgeous. Right, Leo's turn. Okay, bracelets on. We're ready to hit the shops. Let's start with Jimmy Choo. Look at these boots, these burgundy boots. Oh, look at them. Oh my gosh, with the, with the little Jimmy Choo. Oh my gosh. They are just a moment, aren't they? I'm kind of loving this burgundy red moment as well. This is like the colour of this season now. The colour of the it's season. It's gorgeous. And I love the little like round toe. Yeah. Slightly between a round and a point. And a pointy toe. It's gorgeous. These are little ankle boots as well. I actually think they're so, so different, aren't they? So nice. They're very similar to my Fendi ones, but with the um, Jimmy Choo logo instead. Look at these pink shoes. So my best friend wore um, the white version of this for her wedding. So I'm going to have to show these pink ones. Simone, if you're watching, I'm sure you will be. These ones are your next purchase, gal. Gosh, they've got so many lovely colours. Look at these chocolate with the croc print. Can we just... Oh, look at those for boots. Look at the sparkle. Heading down for some food now. Leo, we're having trouble. Oh, I'm really struggling. I've never <gasps> ever struggled to spend money before. I struggle to save money. I should not say that. But I'm there sorry. are some biggies that we've not been to yet. We've yeah, not there been are. To Dior. And also, like when you're spending, like you know, they have to be real thought about yeah, really, purchases. Yeah. I'm not just here to spend willy-nilly because that's not yeah. what I do. I think about, you know, those purchases 100%. through the year that you are going to wear yeah. for years to come. I got very lucky with my purchase. I won't tell you what I bought, but I described to Leo something that I was looking for and I found it. Literally the exact I thing she was, it. and that's something that, you know, I've said to you, I'm looking for certain yeah. things and I can't find and those just things. Struggling. And I'm not going to go and spend we money winning find, We did find one thing that didn't have your size. Yeah, I would have <gasps> bought those because they were mm -hmm. beautiful and I have been really needy Needing a pair yeah. of chocolate stilettos because then I just don't have a pair yeah. but they didn't have my size I've been looking for a chocolate coat yeah I just want to be a huge piece of chocolate basically yeah. <laughs> there's nothing wrong with that but anyway we are heading down to grab some food now yeah. um, this is when I knew me and Leo were gonna be such good friends because I said I said to Leo what food are you feeling and we both said at the same time everything everything all everything out. everything all out. so basically soulmates that's how I know she's a girl after my own heart <laughs> should we go and eat darling oh I'm Hank Let's Marvin <laughs> it's time for food drinks 
have arrived. Good food. Cheers, darling. Cheers. Merry Christmas. Cheers to a nearly successful shopping day. I hope successful. We're <laughs> trying. We're really trying. Ordered half the restaurant. Hi, thank you. Oh, Mancini. Mancini. Parmigiana. Favourite meal of all time, the Parmigiana. It's epic. <laughs> Thank you so much. Wow. 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 So we just had the most delicious dinner and we've come outside and the Christmas lights are on. Look at this. Wow. So magical here at this time of year. I've forgotten how lovely it was. Look at all the lights and the trees all around here. Oh, it's just so, so lovely. <laughs> Clothes today. It's been more di shoes and bags. Not shoes bad. Shoes and bags. Epic. Shoes just as they bags. wish they had our size or oh, my size. No. Oh. But we've just had a lovely dinner, putting the world to right. Not having a we? good girly catch. We were sat there for two. I was about to say two years. <laughs> two years. Two years. Two years. Two hours. Just. We were just going in. Out. We? I'm not talking sure. all things social media, YouTube, yep. personal, relationships. Honestly, we're I, actually very similar in so many different ways. We are. Ways. It's so strange how two people can come from completely different backgrounds but have so many similarities. So much in common. I feel like I could write you're now. You're just a great human. Oh, you're, you're a great human. human. I'm looking at sharing the love. Love you, darling. We've had such oh, a lovely okay. time so far, though, Next haven't we? Next time, I say, we get a driver oh, and we're absolutely <laughs> legless. But that is quite dangerous. We can't this Shopping. The, this is the extra mm. level of bougie that I need on the next one. Oh, I'm, I'm ready. I'm ready, ready. to be ready. And I promise you next time we'll do full styling <laughs> sessions. Yeah. I'm saying to Alex, I would need to be like, I need to be slightly more Leah, cool. want, Leah wants to be edged up a bit. I want to be edged, I just, be edged up I bit. just look so silly. Don't look I do, You silly. saw me in the bucket hat. Yeah, but not many, you people, guys can pull up, not many people can pull off a bucket hat, come on. You would look great in a bucket I hat. I would not wear a bucket you hat. You would be like Emily in Paris vibes. Emily in Paris vibes. But cool Emily in Paris. Oh. I just look like an absolute nana. No, you don't. But there's the pigeon woman coat. In oh, case yeah, you wanted to spend £6,000 on a coat that, that makes you look like pigeon. Like the Pigeon woman, the lady at Mary Poppins. Yeah, feed the birds. Tuppence a bag. <laughs> Tuppence. Tuppence. The Holland Cooper window looking super festive at Vista Village. They've got a beautiful garland around the window. Got their new Christmas candles, presents. They've really done their window beautifully. So let's go and have a little look. I really love this coat with the, um, the shoulders like this and the buttons. That's gorgeous. Really, really nice. Having a little look around Holland Cooper. Gorgeous blazer. They've literally got all of their stock in here. What are these? Oh, chocolate brown breeches. <gasps> Oof, these might have to go on my Christmas list. Oh my gosh, look at these leather tan gloves. Beautiful. We've got good old Ralph's coffee. Chilling out, look how festive it looks. Look at that with the wreath on the front. Oh, it looks so pretty. Might maybe grab a little coffee before I go. Just popped into Ralph Lauren. I always forget how big it is in here. We're gonna see what goodies they've got. Look at how. I have decked it out this year. It looks beautiful. We're on the hunt for some classic knitwear. Wow, that is so, so cute. Oh, what do we think? Oh my gosh. What do we like? That is so cute. I, quite I thought this is our section over this here. Is our se I've actually, oh my God, Look wait for it. Clothes. Okay, I no, don't really I do Christmas this. jumpers. No, I know. Have you seen the bottoms to match? 
I abs- there's something about that that I just I love. I actually need it. I need it too. Should we have magic? <gasps> Look how oh sweet that so cute. is. Okay. So cute. So cute. Gorgeous okay. neutral knitwear down here. Oh. oh my gosh, look at this shearling long gilet over the jumper. I obviously have a bit too cream. I love that. But I think with like a little... Have you got some really nice sort of camel brown trousers or... That would look gorgeous camel. one. Oh. Dress with a tie. Oh, it's got a tie waist? Got a tie waist. I was about to say that, that's an extra large. That's why it looks yeah, quite big. it's a little bit big. I'm loving all of these neutrals over here. Look at this cable knit dress. Oh my gosh, Leo, I found. Oh my God. Look at the teddy jumper. Leo, you know we said about getting matching teddy jumpers. So sweet. Just saw these stunning chocolate and black boots in Ralph Lauren. Unfortunately, they don't have my size, but these were £609 and they're down to 182 but I do think these are so gorgeous. I'd love a flat version of these as well, but yeah, we've got the Ralph Lauren stitching there. I think they're super. This is looking more promising, Leo. Yeah. You, you've got a smile on your well, face got, now. Like, serious sale items. Yeah. Now, I've had this blazer in navy. My dad bought it for me on, I yeah. think, like my 18th or 19th birthday and it was you know, it was a serious investment and something I've had for years and years and years and I've worn it a hundred times. This is the same blazer but in khaki. A fraction. <laughs> like of the price. cashmere as well. Full a hundred percent. Hundred percent cashmere. Gold it's, buttons. The, the colour is gorgeous. It's yeah, you could so even wear nice. it with the cream. We're both trying on the same cream dress Yay! because we both couldn't resist. Oh, so gorgeous. so nice. Right, should we head to changing rooms? Yeah. So I oh sorry the lights a little bit <laughs> bad in here. I tried on this cream dress. Now, I absolutely love the shape and the fit. However, you'll see I am covering up my breasticle area because it is slightly see-through. However, I love the shape. I love where it finishes, whereby you can still kind of wear knee-high boots, but it's got that little bit of girly flair at the end. It's tie waist at the back there, but can you see? where my tights start that for me for the price i don't expect it to be see-through so yeah won't be buying this on um, this occasion but if i could find a dress this shape so perfect for over the winter and festive season but yeah such a shame it's just a little bit see-through oh well and that's us guys that's a wrap for bista village we've had the most amazing day haven't we it has so been lovely. so wholesome, yeah. so festive and just had the most incredible girly catch yeah. up. There's been great food, great shopping. There's been snow. It even <laughs> snowed, even snowed for us. But yeah, you've got some good bargains. I bargains? literally got bargains. 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 I got the deal of the century yeah. in the last shop. It always happens, doesn't it? It does. You're going to have to go over to Leo's channel though tomorrow to see what she bought and then I will show you guys tomorrow what I bought as well but I would show you today but it's a little bit dark it does it won't do my purchases any justice no. so no Leo's going I'm home I'm going to love now. you and leave you so I'm going to go oh. home it has been so gorgeous it's been so nice. I'm sure spending the day with you guys I'm sure we will um we'll see you again soon oh, I, think, well, I hope so unless you just like you know no, leaves you're... this friendship no I will put you <laughs> down <laughs> no we you are welcome back on this channel with open arms darling but well, it's been such a pleasure. So good. Merry Bye. Christmas, guys. <laughs> Back home to my little family. Hello, Bolly Boo. Hello, Desi. Have you missed me? Have you missed me? And Andy. <laughs> Hello, my pops. Hello. Have you had a good day? This little face. Do you like my bracelet? Let me show you my bracelet that's got your little initials on. Oh, Desi's like, I like it, Mummy, I like it. Andy, you're not upset, are you? That I didn't get your initial on my bracelet? I am very upset. <laughs> I did explain that I felt like getting an A, even though I would know it stands for Andy. I just look a bit... It's just, I don't know, it's a bit lame getting your own initial on your bracelet. What is wrong with you? And then I thought, shall I get both of our initials? But then he would say AA. Yeah, that's uh, fine. What? I look like I work for the AA? Yeah. 
the road service people. Oh dear, oh God, that light's a bit horrible. Anyway, as you can see, I'm back home with all of my favorite little one. Oh my God, look at him. Is that the squirrel making the best pillow? Oh, he's like, no, not anymore. You're just the happiest little one. Well, it is, what time is it? It has just gone half past eight and I'm actually about to end the day uh, the exact same way I started it. I'm gonna make myself a cup of tea. Um, oh, I think I'm actually gonna take it upstairs to bed with me. Um, I'm quite tired. I wanna go and oh, get my makeup off, do my skincare. Um, as I said, have a cup of tea, get into bed. And yeah, I've got some, um, I've got some YouTube videos that I wanna catch up with, so. I think I'm gonna do that. Get a nice cup of tea, get in bed, and watch some YouTube. I love that for me. Guys, I really hope you enjoyed today's video. I hope you enjoyed coming shopping with me and Leo. I am going to show you tomorrow what I bought from Bista Village. I know that's a little bit of a tease, but as you can see, it's so dark now, and you know, I wanna show my purchases in the best light, so. I'll save that for tomorrow's vlog, so stay tuned tomorrow to find out what I bought from Bista. But as always, guys, I will love you and leave you. Stay tuned for tomorrow's Vlogmas episode. And as always, I will see you in the next one. Bye, guys. Bye.